Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to try to be quick, but it's not going to be easy because I have got this gigantic thank you from Brenda at Boodles Doodles Designs. Um, this is just an amazing little Etsy shop that she makes handcrafted soaps and oh my god, they are just so, so beautiful. So if you check out her Etsy store, you will be there for a while looking at her beautiful designs. She also has a YouTube channel and I actually watched one of her videos the other day of how she was uh, blending the different soaps and uh, putting different colors in and the designs and then decorating the tops of it. And she just put so much love and so much care and so much precision into it that I am going to be buying from them for quite a while. So again, I will link Brenda below. Her shop again was Boodles Doodles Designs in case I, I always mess up her name for some reason. But anyway, she had uh, seen my video I had bought some uh, soaps around um, Halloween that I, I saw her trick-or-treat soaps and I just thought they were going to be something just so cute just to send to the grandkids and then I bought some other soaps and yeah I had a lot of fun and I'm using uh, some of her soaps right now they are they just lather beautifully you feel clean after you use them but it's, some of the soaps lately that I've been buying some handmade soaps they're stripping my, my, my moisture. So even if I just use it as a hand soap, just after using the restroom, my hands just feel dry. I cannot wait to go put some hand lotion on. And like in the shower, some of the other companies, when you get out, you're just so stripped of moisture that you have to put on like Cetaphil or something. And I don't mind using Cetaphil after, but I wanna, if I'm running late, cause um, maybe I got up late, I wanna take a quick shower before I go to work. I don't wanna have to spend an extra five minutes trying to blend that in. I want my soap to moisturize me. And so far, these are doing it. But anyway, she had, uh, and again, she had seen my um, video that I posted on YouTube. So she wanted to send me a thank you gift. So she had sent me a, a little email, little message that said, um, thank you. And she was sending me a little something. And I think when I showed this to you, was it two weeks ago? Yeah, I'm dead. Um, this is, this is not a little something. This is huge. And yeah, and it just, when you open it, I mean, the inside of my mailbox, when I took it out, it just smelled like Christmas. This is chock, chock full of goodies here from her shop. It smells amazing. So right on top, it smells exactly like Christmas. So, and of course, the first things that I'm pulling out are some of her wax melts. And this one is called Christmas Wreath. And this one, it, this is what I am smelling when I open this box. This is just like a freshly cut pine wreath or pine tree or Christmas tree smells amazing. This is going to smell nice in my warmers. She also sent some blueberry wax melts. And these are sweet. So these ones, and I, it's not as potent as the Christmas tree. So I want to try to open this. But this is just like blueberries, just nice and fresh and sweet. So anyway, her name is Brenda. And um, I first, uh, I think I met her through a Facebook group that I had joined on um, doing some planning and uh, just, um, you know, doing the uh, the own conjuring planners and things like that. And her daughter had posted, oh, my mom has a, a shop. And so she had originally got started her Etsy shop doing like planner supplies and for the weekly kits and things like that, monthly kits. And I think this is probably more of her passion. And yeah, so I wish her well because these are just amazing. So again, some more of the wax melt, some more Christmas tree, and then two more of the blueberries. So this one is like some big rosettes. And then another blueberry of the stars. All right, so let me move these over. And now let's get into, so she's uh, sent me some soaps. So she's got all the ingredients of her soaps listed on the back, so it's all natural ingredients. And also on her shop, because I was on uh, this weekend, and, uh, and I'm not sure if it's just a Black Friday sale or um, how long it is, but um, she's coming out with her first uh, limited edition uh, gift box for the holidays. So normally it's $47.95, but right now it's on sale on her website for 25% off, 
for $35.96. And at first I wasn't going to get it because I thought, oh, you know, I've got so many soaps. And then I had to get into this and I said, oh, I bet there's soaps in here and I've got so many. I really don't need it. But I couldn't pass it up. So, you know, I ordered it. And I think it's already shipped. That's how fast she is. So this one is called, I forgot to show you the name. This one is called Playroom Floor Soap. And this one, it's sweet. It smells kind of like Fruit Loops. I got kids fruity cereal. So she's got like Legos here on the top. A nice and colorful with like the uh, the basic colors for a kid's playroom. And then foamy soap on top. Just really, really cute. And again, to me, it smells like Fruit Loops. So this would be a great one. I mean, it's pretty, it smells nice. Oh, it's got like, um, I think those are elephants on that side. Yeah, so really, really cute. Yes, I think this one is going to make its way to the jelly beans because I bet they would love that uh, fruit loop soup. So, not soup, because it does say, this is soap, do not eat, and her dress. So again, it's Boodles Doodles Designs, and I, I'm just loving her products. They are just, oh, they're all so beautiful. She has so many different designs. So this one is called Piney. Well, it's called Piney Wood Soap. Alrighty. And again, on the back, the, I won't show you the back of every one because they're, they're all the same, because they're all the same basic ingredients. Isn't that weird how sometimes it focuses and then sometimes it doesn't? But anyway, they're all going to be the same basic ingredients. It's just going to be used whatever. Uh, the difference will be just whatever essential oils that she uses to get the, uh, the scents. I should have got scissors. Okay. Oh, I can see some nice glitter on this one. When you open it, and some Christmas trees. So good to see the inside of that when you open it up. We got frosting, it looks like frosting, and some gold swirls. Sometimes they're a little harder to get. Oh, this one's pretty too. So this is green and some maybe red or like a burgundy color. But look at the top of that with the uh, Christmas trees and the gold swirl. Just very, very pretty. It smells not so strong like a strong, strong pine tree. Like a Christmas, not like that Christmas pine, but a nice like a pine grove or something that does smells nice and it's so pretty. And with the pine trees on it, evergreen trees, it'll be perfect to put out like in your soap dish for Christmas. And this is pure as snow. Alrighty, Ooh, this one's pretty too. Like I said, they're all just so beautiful. She put so much into decorating the soaps, too. So this is beautiful blue and some gray silver swirls in here. And like a blueberry on top. So just so pretty. And this one, it's very, and it's sparkly on top, too. I don't know if the sparkles are coming out. Yes, there you go, and some maybe some snowflakes. But it's um, it's like a really fresh scent, not like mint, it's not like an evergreen, but just like fresh, fresh air, crisp, fresh air, being out in the snow after a nice snow. So this one's really, really, really pretty too. Love the colors in this. And there's still more. So this one is Night Blooms soap. And if I was smart, I could probably just go to her, her website and you wouldn't have my idea what it's, ooh, this one's pretty too. And because it probably says right on her website what they are. But, so this is another black one. It's like black and tan. Oh my gosh, this one smells amazing. So again, it's like black and tan swirls. Something on top, not sure what it is, but this smells amazing. 
So this is like my favorite flower again. So this is like gardenia. It's got such a gorgeous scent to it. Rose, some honeysuckle, maybe jasmine. But wow, I love this. This is smells gorgeous. And this more. Alrighty, so she's just getting into some lip balms too. These are sealed in plastic, so I won't open them, but it's a lip balm. Clear, and again, what it contains, so just all, and it says lavender, woohoo. Frankincense and Roman chamomile essence oils. Oh my God, this is gonna smell amazing. And uh, this one is uh, the same thing, but it's in a palest pink. It's a beautiful color. And I'm not sure if that's gonna come out, but it um, looks like it's got the same fragrances. So you still have the, uh, the coconut oil, the cocoa butter, vitamin E, beeswax, lavender, fran frankincense, Roman chamomile essential oils. Everything is eth ethically sourced. So very nice. I got two more. So another one of the pale pink and another one of the clear. See if I can. Okay, so pale pink, upside down. So I'm going to go, I'm going to be using those a lot. And okay, back to some soap. So this is cranberry balsam. And, well, you know, I wanted it to be a surprise, otherwise I should have had these open, but I really wanted to show you, oh, this is like Hershey Kisses or something. I mean, just when you open it, if you were giving this as a gift, imagine somebody's face opening these. Of course, it's cranberry balsam, so it's cranberries, not Hershey Kisses. Oh my gosh, this smells nice too. So this is beautiful. It's kind of like a caramel tan. There's some red and some green in here. I got sparkles and the frothiness up on top. So this is, um, I can smell the cranberries and like a balsam fur, but it's not overwhelming. So this is really nice. And again, a really nice Christmas scent. And there's still more. Alrighty, so this is a nourishing nail oil. So I think she's starting to branch out into some other natural items. So that'll be good because, yeah, I need to do some kind of nail treatment. So I'm going to love using that. And we've got more soaps to go. Like I said, this is more than just a little something, Brenda. And this is that Dirty Birdie soap. This is the one, um, one that I got, and I really love, love that fragrance. And, um, this is one that was on sale, and I think most of our soaps are probably somewhere between four to six dollars, so it's not expensive at all. And this one, well, I actually bought it because it reminded me of, um, you know, Easter peeps, and I love Easter peeps. But she had these at a reduced rate because she didn't like the way the uh, design came out, but I think it's perfect. So we've got that kind of cranberry color red, some black, kind of like that teal blue and cream. We've got these peeps on top with some sparkles oh my god this smells amazing so to me maybe it's coconut maybe some pineapple peach and again that gardenia and honeysuckle maybe a little bit of jasmine just oh my god this is gorgeous this is one of my favorite scents here. so this one and that other one that had the uh, scents in it too and last one, this is called Black Cherry Soap. And again, you can see these are all a great size. And well packaged. And I mean, none of these were broken. I mean, and they were jam packed in that box. This paper just to just really protect them the way she packs them. And again, I mean, if you're giving this as a gift to someone, if you want to make a little gift basket, I mean, just when they open it, look at how dang cute this is. 
So we got the cherries, we got the leaves, that pink behind it. And uh, so we got black and that kind of cranberry going through it and the green, the sparkles on top. Oh my God, this is sweet. This is like sweet, sweet cherry that you feel like you just had some cherry pie and you can feel it back here, but you want more because it tastes so good and it smells so good. Yeah, I can see why they have to put that disclaim on the back about it. So do not eat because, oh my God, they smell amazing. Oh my gosh. I don't even know which one is my favorite, but they are so beautiful. I can just see making a little gift basket for somebody with these and oh my god they are gonna enjoy them so much oh so i i don't want, i don't know what to say brenda this is this is amazing i mean this this was a lot and i appreciate it but it's something you definitely did not have to do but um yeah your products are amazing i love them they're beautiful they smell wonderful um using them they're just easy to hold um just using them every day they're just um it lathers nice you feel clean it's not stripping my skin of oils it just they're very moisturizing i can't say enough about this and to just get something like this out of the blue it's it was amazing i i can't believe you did that brenda but anyway i hope that you check out her etsy shop she's also got a youtube channel that i'll link below and you can see her making the soaps and the care that she puts into making them it's they are truly a work of art they are all so beautiful. I should have left them all out of the package and kind of put them all together. Do I leave more out? So you can kind of see these all together. I think I got more that I left in the package, but do you see how beautiful they are? Just the colors, it's the scents, and thank you so much, Brenda. I, I don't even know what to say. I am, I am speechless. This is, oh my gosh, this is so sweet of you. So again, I am going to leave Boodles Doodles Designs, uh, their Etsy shop below, and her YouTube channel. And I hope you check her out. I mean, uh, this was uh, this is this is great, Brenda. I don't know what to say. So, uh, thank you so much for your kindness, and these will go to good use. I am going to be the cleanest person around. You know that. So anyway, thank you everyone for joining me. Um, again, I hope you check out uh, Brenda's website, her Etsy shop. And um, thank you all for joining me. I hope you go out and have a fantastic week. I hope you give this video a thumbs up. And um, yeah, just thank you everyone for your support. And we'll chat later. Bye-bye.